the Desert Orchid Chase is next. This is a Grade 2 over two miles. Uh, the big field for this. I think the King is at the top for Joshua Sutherland. Footing Con, Vinnie Gerard. Good Night Largo, James Shea. I am Spartacus, Paul Rhodes, Kuiping Kojak, Vinnie Gerard. Casban Trip, Alex Cherry, Latte Sergeant, Padraig Hogan, Lord Gale Martin, Needham, Ozzy Putra, David Robertson, Samba, Alex Cherry, The Ranting Art, Graham Clitterbuck, The Smiler, Joshua Sutherland, Wade Bridge, Darren Thompson, Alien Invasion, Leon Van Rensburg, By Chance, David Hooley, Kayleigh's Wald, James Shea, Kafina De Niro, for Paul Rhodes, Fedora Fields, David Robertson, Lacinia Stellina, for Craig Beckwith, and Time and Eternity, Leon Van Rensburg. So, a field of 20 for this then. I think there are too many two and a half mile chases this week. And all called in, and away they go. And Lacinia Stellina on the near side. Gets a bit of a step on the rest of them. The great Cadiz Wall being driven up to dispute the lead, and those two will take us over the first of the 13, at which Latte Sergeant made a mistake at the back, but got away with it as they race towards the second then. This will be the second last next time round, and they're all safely over it this time, with Latte Sergeant already struggling out the back on debut. But it's Cayley's Wald who comes into this next one in the lead, and gets over it nicely from Lucinia Stellina in second. Fedora Fields is third on the inside, then wider on the track is Casban Trip, Alien Invasion, the Runting Art and Lord Gale are also close up towards the back footing con in the Vinnie Gerard Clause with the pink cap is at the back of the ones we can see but Latte Sergeant is the actual back marker somewhere drift off the rest so Kenley's Wald is the leader then by about a length and a half as they make their way onto the back part of the track and over the water jump and they race away to the furthest point and then head back and it's Kayleigh's Wald in the lead by length to Lucinia Stellina in second gap of three or four then to Fedora Fields as they get over the fifth which they're all safely over. One or two are struggling at the back. They're quite well strung out. But it is a two mile on their set of their stiff pace. This leading pair as they all stream over that ditch. And the Sydney Stellina has now got the lead from Kayleigh's Wald in second. Aussie Pewter is three lengths back in third. Stable mate Fedora Fields is fourth. Then comes out an invasion of the Smiler. Casban trips after that one with Lord Gale on its inside. Caffeina De Niro is on the rail. The Ranting Art is close to that one as well. And after that one comes the, the Grey Goodnight Largo. And wide on the track is Footing Con making a bit of a forward move. And looking towards the back, by chance is now the last of the ones in sight. I've got no idea where Latte Sergeant's gone as they get over the seventh. And they're all safely over the seventh as well. With Lucinia Stellina, the leader by about a length, to Cayley's Wald in second. They're queuing up behind and they're getting close to mistake by the David Robertson Horse for Dora Fields. They're seeing that one shuffle down the pack a little bit, but it's Lucinia Stellina and Cayley's Wald still disputing the lead. Aussie Future and the Smiler are getting much closer. Cafina De Niro's moved off the fence and is now going well in fifth as they get over that ditch. And they're all safely over the ditch with one that's dropped to the back now, Wade Bridge, but it's Cayley's Wald in the lead then. They've only got the fences in the straight to take on this fourth last and over it they go and they're all safely with their fourth last so just the three in the straight to go then and Aussie Pewter has now taken it up from Kafina De Niro in second Kayleigh's Walsh trying to fight back then comes the Smiler and Ranting Art the Senior Stellina still there in that group uh, Lord Gale is going wide so too is Alien Invasion Time and Eternity is trying to get into it one or two of these going very wide on the turn but it's Aussie Pewter and Samba uh, Aussie Pewter on the inside is the leader Samba's in second look at this uh, Kuiping Kojak going around the outside moving into second as they take the third last and it's Aussie Pewter in the lead from Kafina De Niro and Kuiping Kojak Cosban triples a faller at the back but it's Aussie Pewter who's two lengths clear coming out of the second last gets over it nicely but slowly being chased by the smile and then comes Kuiping Kojak here comes Alien Invasion now with a run inside the final furlong over the last they go and it's Aussie Pewter in the lead being chased by Alien Invasion but it looks like Aussie Pewter has got enough in hand and racing up towards the line it's a comfortable win for Aussie Pewter from Alien Invasion in second and close for third, Latinia still in a coping coach at the ranting art ran on. Latte Sergeant got round at his own time. And it's a win for David Robertson's Aussie Putra, who's absolutely slaughtered them really. A competitive field grade two, and he's taken it by a good four lengths. And I've got a feeling that might be a newcomer making its first run. I don't remember commentating on it before, and it's rated out of hundreds, so that's every possibility. That's a debut win for Aussie Pewter and David Robertson. Certainly one to watch when it comes around to the champion chase then. So let's get the rest of the place in. Second was Alien Invasion, Leon Van Rensburg, Lacinia Stellina, Craig Beckwith, Kuiping Kojak, Vinnie Gerard was fourth, and the ranting art for Graham Clutterbuck ran on into fifth. <laughs>